Mankind has evolved throughout the years and managed to create everything from practically nothing. Whether it was the feat of controlling fire or the invention of electricity. And somehow from living in caves we have managed to create skyscrapers. The distances that we needed months to cover are now easily accessible thanks to the devices we have in our pockets. The whole world has become within our grasp. We have managed to find what's at the bottom of the ocean as well as touch the moon, a feat that was once considered to be an impossible task. Yet, we're still not at our peak as we will continue to explore and solve other hidden mysteries of this universe. Yet among them all, one thing that never ceases to mystify me is the act of communication. All these years of development could have never happened if language was never the first to develop. Hear here understanding me because I'm talking in a language that you can understand. It truly really surprises me how the whole world, even after being separated by oceans, managed to communicate with each other in the past. Throughout the years, language progressed, and now in the vast reality called Internet, languages have managed to evolve even further and create words like base, cringe, and poggers. And in the vast new language, one word always makes me think. Ooh. Three letters, two syllables, and two alphabets. And yet it creates more mystery than the vast and unexplored universe itself. Ooh. Is it a face? Is it a sound? Or is it the key to solving the greatest wonders of human society? Perhaps it is all of them. Or perhaps it is neither. Humans have evolved and managed to answer even the hardest of questions, but why is it that a simple person like me is unable to unravel the mysteries of such a simple word? Or is the word truly so divine that the answer is beyond the hands of a commoner like me? I don't know. Maybe it is all just about perception. Maybe it is about how one apprehends it. To some it may be a face. To others, it could be an expression. Maybe to some, it is divine consolation, and maybe to others, a deadly threat. Truly, it makes one ponder about life and how they live it. What could be the way of life to you can be a curse to another. Are the ones using U right? Are the ones not using U just? Or are they both honorable in their own ways? What is being right? There is a possibility we shall never know. However, this truly begs the question, is O the same as well?